In this video, I'm going to share everything I bought while I was in Spain. So I originally filmed separate videos for each store, but I was like, that's too much. And I should condense them into one video. So that's what I'm doing. And I will have markers if you're only interested, I don't know, in certain things in the video, you'll know exactly when I'm gonna feature those. But in this video, I'm gonna feature my Zara haul, my Bershka haul, what I got at Fendi, what I got at um, Celine, basically everything I bought condensed into this video. So if that's something you're interested in, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss future videos such as this one. And let's get started. So as y'all know, denim is huge, cargos are huge, bodycon type of denim, like corset styles are huge for the fall winter season. So I capitalized on those pieces in Spain, starting with this first piece, which is a dress and it's denim and it has a corset top. I really love this. I fell in love with it when I saw it and it fits like a glove. It's perfect. I did size up because I didn't want it to be too tight. I actually got a size large in this and I kept the tags on everything I think. And this was actually 49.95 euros. I'm quite sure this will be available on the US site. Again, I'll link it down below so you can check it out. But this is a Euro or Europe size large, USA size large. And I just love how this fits. It's like bodycon style. It has seamed all the way down and it's super long. Also love the bottom hemline. It is distressed, but not too distressed. It's just raw on the edges. It's unfinished, but it also has a back zipper too. So you can squeeze everything in nice and tight. The medium fit me. I just didn't want it to be too tight. <laughs> Not too, 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 too tight, but it's still tight enough to where it fits really well. And it also holds my boobs quite nicely. Such a great piece for the fall winter. A nice transitional piece too. You can style it with boots. You can style it with flats if you're into those. I'm personally not, okay? If you wanna style it with heels, with sandals, you can do that as well. You can layer it as well. You can put it over a button down. You can put a cardigan over it. So many different ways you could wear this and I cannot wait to do it. So I'm just gonna continue in order. I do have another dress I'm gonna show you. I know. I got, I said I'll not buy another pair of jeans, but this, I had to make an exception. These also came from the Zara in Spain and these were 39.95 euros. Size six. So I sized up a little bit cause they don't really have much stretch, but these are just some, they're wide leg. They're not super tight. They're, they fit, but they're kind of slightly baggy, but they're not overly baggy. So if you want them baggier, you might want to size up even more. But this is what they look like. They basically have like paint splatter all over them, all over them. I don't have anything like this in the wardrobe. That's why I wanted to grab these, but this is what they look like. They are great length as well. They are kind of cropped on me a little bit, but that's totally fine because I can show my shoes off. But if you're shorter, they'll be great length for you they will be a great length for you because they are basically floor length if you're not 5'8 and up. They have a little bit of give, but not too much. I mean, you know, you can kind of make it work, but if you have curves, definitely size up. My typical size is US size four now. That's your girl. Your girl been working. Yeah, again, size up if you need more room, but y'all know how you can style these. You can dress them up or down. Obviously, well, not really. You can kind of dress them up a little bit. I mean, even though they have paint splattered, it kind of like carpenter style, you can still dress them up if you want. Don't let that limit you. I should also quickly mention, they have like, I think in Barcelona, there were 14 Zars. We also went to Madrid and in Madrid, there are 18 Zars, which is freaking crazy. If you didn't know, Zars actually based in Spain. That's like their home base. So there's Zars like at literally every corner. You can walk two minutes down the street and there's another Zar, it's crazy. I didn't go to all of them, but um, I went to a lot of them <laughs> just to find some pieces while I was there. But I also got these loose fit Bermudas. That's what they're called. I sized up in these two because these don't have any stretch either. I got a US size eight and these were 25.95 euros. I love these. I love a little bit of the stressing. I love the colors of the color of these two. It's like a, uh, like a beige stone wash light stone wash kind of color. And they're also, you know, obviously they're Bermudas, so they're not gonna be super short. And I just like the way they fit. I mean, five pockets. And believe it or not, these can also be transitioned pretty well. You can even style them up with a blazer if you wanted to do kind of a dressed up, dressed down type of look. A button down, a sweater, a t-shirt if it's still warm. 
a bodysuit. You can dress these up however you like, a pair of heels. A couple more denim pieces. I got this crop. If you would have told me a couple years ago I'd be wearing crop tops again, I would not have believed you, but I worked really hard to get where I am. And you know, I don't take that lightly. I'm not bragging or anything, but I've worked really hard to get where I am to shed some extra weight. And I want to reward myself. So I actually like how crop tops look on me now and I'm comfortable wearing them now, even though I'm, I'm still not quite where I want to be. Like I want to, you know, fine tune a few more things, but for the most part, I'm almost there. But this is like a corset top, and not a corset, but a crop tank. Like a corset fit, it fits a little tighter, but I did size up because um, this was 35.95 euros, but I really love this. I am a bit concerned about the rhinestones, but I don't expect to have this forever. I mean, crystals are kind of a thing that's trending. Crystals on denim is trending. And I just really wanted to add something like this to my wardrobe and not pay a whole lot because I don't expect to wear it forever. But so many different ways you can dress this up. A pair of nice trousers. You could do a double denim moment. You can layer it under a blazer. You can do it with, you know, anything really. Shorts, if it's still warm, a skirt. So many different ways you can wear this. Also, the straps aren't adjustable but it does zip up at the back, so you don't have to ha uh, take too much effort to put it on, which is great. I really love this. I love everything I got. I mean, I'm not just saying that. <laughs> Last slight denim piece, and I say slight because it's more of a lighter, it's not even really denim. I would say it's more of a, kind of a cross between denim and linen. I got this as an, in a size medium, and this is a cropped button down moment, and I'm gonna show you the details, but it does button up. The buttons are hidden underneath this flap, which I like, so they're not visible. Some people might like that. I like it because you can wear it open or closed, or you can leave it open here if you wanna show your necklaces, or you can button it all the way to the top and then show your necklaces that way. That's more of the style I tend to wear it. This was 25.95 euros, and I love the back of it the main reason I got it. I love it. It like flaps open. I really like that. So it's a nice cropped button down and it opens at the back. It's like a little surprise at the back. Now as far as styling, I mean, you could even do these two together if you wanted, like, and that would be nice. Or you could do this too, actually, with Bermudas. And that would be a nice, like what, a pair of heels? Oh yeah, yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. So I actually got two dresses. I'm starting to get more into dresses, especially these. And these, okay, so ignore this. This is like the hanger strap. So you'll see me when I try it on, obviously. But this is another cargo style. And y'all know, I love camouflage. This was like camel camouflage. I would have been dying in this video, but this is good enough. I love all the pockets. It's like a cargo pocket camouflage dress. I got this in a size medium. So this is true to size. Um, I would wear probably a shapewear underneath this because it's super fitted. I wanted this to be that way. And I love it because it has the zipper here. So it's like a front slit dress moment. There's no slits on the back, no pockets, anything like that. All the pockets are on the front. So it zips all the way up or down. So you can even make this shorter if you want it because the zipper works both ways. There's a zipper pull here, and then there's another zipper pull at the bottom. So you can have it open more, have it open at the top more. These are functional pockets. They're not just there. The things that aren't, aren't functional are the zippers here. So they just flap open. You know, they don't zip closed or anything like that. And the bottom, the pockets are also functional. Same thing, the zipper is kind of, uh, yeah, you can't put anything in there. It just, merely for decoration, but I, I love this. I cannot wait to wear this on date night. Same ideas with the other dress. You could dress it up with booties, with heels, with flats, with sneakers even, if you want to dress it more down. I plan on doing some styling videos with these, so look forward to that. I'm gonna tell y'all the price, I don't think I did. I think I might have, I don't know. This was 49.95 euros. I kinda went crazy on the dresses, all right? But look. Look, listen, I was in Spain. I don't know when I'm going back. I am going back, I just don't know when. Okay, so I got this as well. This is kind of like a, you know, a utilitarian type of dress. Not necessarily cargo, because it doesn't have any pockets. The only pocket it has is the one on the back here. 
but this was 39.95 euros and i got this in a size medium but love the color this is a true khaki and this fits really nicely too doesn't have it has a size zipper here to get it on in case you're kind of like curious about that also i love this belt it's not removable which is kind of annoying if i wanted to wear with a different type of belt but i guess i don't mind that i could cut it if i wanted to but i don't think it's not worth it <laughs> what i love about this too it has front pockets i live for a dress with pockets and also now i have front slit and there's a back slit i love that and again same idea with the others booties heels flats sandals sneakers you can get a true utilitarian moment with this whether you dress it up or down but i feel like this will work better if you dress it down in my opinion but you could definitely dress it up also if you're enjoying this video be sure to subscribe so you don't miss any more of my fashion videos like this I'm not sponsored. I just really like the store. It's my first time actually going in one. I've heard of it. I've seen it, but I've never gone inside one. But I'm so glad I did. It found some great pieces. Uh, and my baby girl wants to say hello. I'm gonna put you on this side so you don't block my mic. Say hey, YouTube. Hey. So basically, Barska is the sister of Zara. They are owned by the same company. And yeah, let's get right into it. So I got quite, a, well not quite a few, I got a few pieces from them. Okay, let's be realistic here. I got this beautiful corset top in this gorgeous chartreuse green. Y'all know this color is trending as well as corsets. And I love this so much. I did size up, I got a size large. This was 17.99 euros, very affordable. Also has a lot of stretch and give for those of you who need extra support. Also, it really holds you in. I love this. I also love, you know, you can wear it open if you want at the bottom or you can button it all the way down to the bottom. And as far as closures, there are hook and eyes all the way from the top to the bottom, kind of like a bra, you know, but I really love this. I love the color of it. It's a great transitional piece. You can wear it under a blazer, with jeans, jeans with a skirt, with shorts, with whatever you want, really. It's a very versatile piece. I am O. So the next three are gonna be denim pieces. I got this gorgeous asymmetrical skirt. Oh my God, I love this so much. I love the fact that it's shorter. So it's like a mini-ish and then it goes to midi length. Love this, I love the color and everything. I got my true size on this, which is a European 36 or US size four. This was 27.99 euros. So I am a US size four now. So I'm actually, more small than I was before I was pregnant. I'm so proud of myself, but I don't know. I just, I just love that. It was so hard to get to this point. Y'all have no idea. Like it took a lot of, a lot of dedication, motivation. Keep go, girl. I could do a video about it on how I did it later. Just let me know if you're interested in something like that. I don't know if you are or not, but I feel like, you know, it's a great thing, especially before I get pregnant again, <laughs> um, which y'all will know when it happens. But anyway, um, this has a side zipper, so that's how you get on and off. And it also has a bit of a stretch too, and it really cinches you in as well. I know I said this for the last thing, but this is so comfortable. This entire skirt, like it feels great. It's not super thick, but it's not thin either. So it's a great transitional piece. It's another one of those pieces. This is something you can wear with a sweater. You can wear with a button down. You can wear it with a bodysuit, a crop top, a corset, uh, crop, a corset top, you know, is so many different ways which you could wear this. It's a great transitional piece to fall. Great summer piece as well. You can even wear it in winter too with some tights and boots. I love this. Got another skirt. So this one is a really, really mini to maxi link. And I love this. I got, I had to size up with this. This is a US size eight because it does not stretch. It's very stiff. And it's a European size 40. This was 29.99 euros it has five pockets okay so there's two in the back and then there's three on the front it has belt loops which i love it reminds me of the alexander wang skirt that i have but i prefer this one better it's cheaper and also i just like how it fits it's not as stiff you know the alexander wang one is really stiff and it's thicker but i don't always want my denim to be thick because your girl gets hot i sweat and it's never cute also don't worry that they don't have burst of stores in the u.s you can easily shop online and have it shipped here. Some people might not like that because you like to try things on. I'm not one of those people. I don't mind ordering three of the same item in different sizes and sending back. 
might take me a year to get it back to the post office, but it gets back eventually, right? So I also got this denim piece, another corset type of blouse. This one has straps that are non-adjustable and it has also hook and eyes here. Um, it doesn't go all the way down. Nope, it doesn't go all the way down. So this part is kind of open here. It's only this part that has the hook and eyes and it has this buckle. I got this in a size large or medium actually. So my true size, I'm actually unsure of the price because I wore it at some point and I took the tags off. I'm sorry, but it wasn't too expensive. Um, I honestly could have done without the buckle. I feel like this makes it younger. Not that I'm old or anything, but you know, it makes it a lot younger. I feel like more of a high school, not even high school, like college. It's hard to describe. I don't mind it though. This is just, you know, something I could have done without, but I got it anyway, because I really liked the black stone wash. I don't have any tops in this color and i thought that it would go great with a black midi skirt that i had to do a double denim moment so that's something you could do with this you could do it with a skirt with a pair of shorts some pants some trousers if you want to dress it up a bit with some heels and i don't know throw a long sleeve on top throw you know a, a moto jacket on top or a jacket of some sort denim jacket even so many different ways you can wear this. That's why I got all these pieces. I wanted things to transition to fall as well as trendy pieces for fall. When I went to Paris, I bought a Fendi bag, um, which I sold because I was not wearing the con one. And then when I went to London, I got a Chanel Coco Handle Mini in denim. And I went back to Fendi for Spain. So yeah, we got another bag. It kind of got smushed though in my carry-on because I had to kind of force stuff in there. But nonetheless, I know I said I would never, ever, ever get a bucket bag, but hear me out. I went in there looking for the um, the mini baguette in light denim and my eyes just stumbled across this and I could not take my eyes off of it. So, uh oh, there we go. So this is what that looks like. This is the Mon Tresor small bucket bag and it's like in this neutral multicolor. So just to give you an idea, I have the colorful multicolor here and that's what that looks like. So this is way more wearable, but it still gives you the same vibes with a bunch of different neutral colors. I just thought it was so cute and it, holds, it has gold hardware on it. And I, of course, saved some money. I'm getting my taxes back and I didn't have to pay duties. And yes, I did report everything I bought. The guy was just super nice this time and I was blessed. So I didn't have to pay any duties. So I truly saved some money on this. Uh, I might do this paper in here uh, just to keep it stuffed out. But this does come with a longer strap or a little mini strap. If you want to do it top handle, I'll go ahead and put that on. So on the side, you have your D-rings one, four, well, actually, this isn't a D-ring. This is just a Fendi logo. Excuse my nose, they need to be redone. This is the ring that the strap goes on or clips on to. I did wear this a couple of days in Spain too, but I really couldn't put much. Like I couldn't put diapers or anything like that in here. It's literally for my things only. But I'll take the paper out so you can see the interior. First. And this is what it looks like. It says Fendi made in Italy right there. There's your interior. So it's a wide open space, structured on the bottom. So it sits flat on any surface. And then there's your top handle. So cute. Long across body strap too. It falls perfectly on me. And once I'm sure once this breaks in, this will be much easier to open and tighten. But right now it's just really tight. You know, it doesn't close all the way at the moment. I don't know if it's supposed to, but it doesn't right now. Okay, if I force it, it can get closer, but I don't know if I want to do that. So that's what it looks like. I think that's, yeah, you can't nobody put their hands in there, all right. You just have to be careful what you put in here because you won't be able to close it that tight. But I'm obsessed. I'm usually obsessed with this. Y'all know I typically don't gravitate towards neutrals, but there is a market in my wardrobe for neutrals, okay? Don't, don't get it twisted. There's a neutral market in my wardrobe and this fills it perfectly. I do plan on protecting this because it is the canvas, it's not leather. Your only leather is along the sides here. And also I noticed this bag was on the Fendi website maybe a couple of weeks ago and now it's completely gone. I don't know if it's discontinued, I don't know if it's sold out, out of stock, 
And if it was out of stock, I feel like it would still show. It would just show out of stock. But it's not on there at all. So I don't know. You can still get it though. And I think um, Satire has it. Illalist has it. Rue La La, I believe, has it too, which, oh. <laughs> it's still more expensive than I paid though, so. Just because I got it in Spain. But yeah, I loved it. It's so cute. Look how adorable it is. I love too how they consider pink as a neutral because I feel like pink is a neutral. Gray, white, brown, different shades of gray. And then your leather is taupe. I just think this is so cute. It's so perfect too. It's the perfect size. Y'all know I don't do big bags too much. I have one big bag, two big bags now. I know. Um, what's wrong with me? Keep it together, all right? But yeah, let me know if you guys want to review on this. They release this all the time in different fabrics, different colors. So you can definitely grab one. Not necessarily this one if you don't want it. They have released this in also more vibrant multicolor uh, combinations. So I love this one. I love this one. And it, it doesn't look like anything else that I have, which is always nice. And I try to do it. So yeah. What I got from Celine in Spain, Barcelona. It's very small. OMG, look at it. I got the Celine Triumph belt, and this is in the smaller size. Oh my gosh, it's in the color khaki as well. This green is absolutely divine. It's a nice and neutral. Y'all know I love green. You can style it so many different ways. I absolutely love this. And this is just really nice. I love the gold hardware. Oh, it's beautiful. I love it. So that's everything I got. Wow, in Spain, I had so much fun. Oh my God, like it's my favorite country now. At first, for the longest, Thailand was number one. Well, now Spain is overtaking this spot. And I'm actually like, I'm trying to talk my husband to move into Barcelona. I love it that much. It like, you have to go, you have to go if you haven't been Barcelona. I love Madrid as well, Madrid. I just love Barcelona, I love everything about it. The food is nice, the people are friendly. They love children, it's very family friendly and it's just nice. It's by the water too, which I thought would be a selling point for my husband to like, let's go. <laughs> but we're going we're gonna to work on that. All right, we're going to continue to work on it. But let me know what you enjoy from my haul the most down below if there's something else, because we will be back, okay? If there's something else you think I should check out when I go back, let me know that too. And in case you missed my last video, check it out here. Talk soon.